Maine's lobster industry is grappling with some new regulations issued today by the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration meant to protect right whales. But fishermen say those rules endanger their livelihoods. A 950 square mile area of the Gulf of Maine will be off limits to traditional lobstering for three months during the most lucrative time of the year. The area stretches from MDI down to eastern Casco Bay and more than 120 vessels will be affected. The plan closes the area to fishing from October through January. We absolutely considered everything and tried our best to get a rule that um, balanced right whale conservation with impact on the fishery um, to make sure that we were conserving right whales as well as keeping the fishery open. Unfortunately, that time period is when the hot spot um, is anticipated and when the highest risk for right whales is. So unfortunately, that was just um, an overlap in that need. The regulations will allow buoyless and ropeless fishing, which is an emerging and experimental technology which Maine fishermen don't currently use. The rules also include modifications to gear to make the lines break more easily. Right whales are prone to becoming entangled in lobster and crab trap lines, though there have been no whale deaths attributed to the Maine lobster gear in more than two decades. We'll have more reaction to today's ruling coming up on New Center Maine at 6 o'clock.